Do you want to start talking first, or do you want me to start talking first? I don't think I've ever started talking first. I think you start talking all the time. I think that it's usually you're the talker. And you're like, rah, 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 and you're like talking my face off the whole time. I don't think I usually talk. Mm -hmm. I feel like about a year after I've met you, I just stopped talking. That is so not true. Oh my absolutely God. true. I'm so I'm Thanksgiving on. weekend, we are going to have to drive all the way from LA to San Francisco. My family lives in Fresno, which is about four hours north in the Central Valley. Um, it's like a Russian part of America where everybody drinks and... So um, we're going to be going all the way up to San Jose, stopping in Fresno. So we have to leave Wednesday night, which is tonight. We have to drive through the night, and we're hopefully going to get to Clovis, which is just outside of Fresno. <sighs> we're driving for we're another be driving tonight. five hours, and then we're sleeping for eight, and then we're driving for four more, and then we're coming back in about 12 hours, driving for another eight. From Long Beach, California, so basically to driving Fresno, for the next week. And just from Fresno to, to San Jose. Which I love. Yes, but I will me. definitely travel this. You know. I will definitely travel for Thanksgiving, especially because my grandparents are about 87, so they're getting up there in the years, so I like to always try to find time to go up with them and visit them. And Thanksgiving food is amazing. We have a disagreement. The best food there has ever been, ever. So always talk about it. You, Thanksgiving food. What is this Thanksgiving food? In my opinion, it's the turkey. Yes. Which is damn dry. <laughs> Depends uh, on how you make it. You have to push potatoes. Smother it with gravy and makes it delicious. So it's turkey, which is dry. Mm -hmm. It's mashed potatoes, which has onions in it, which Not is all the obviously time. a bad idea to begin with. <laughs> and there's a what is stuffing. it? Stuffing. The it's thing the that has everything in it. Yeah, bread and celery and carrots and so they bake it. So there's definitely way too many things in one dish. Which could be split into two or three, if you ask me. Yeah, but the food is just so good, and I always feel so bad because I'm eating so much, and you're over there like with like a little baby portion of turkey and like three tablespoons of mashed potatoes. This people are staring at him like crazy. there's something wrong. Why did you bring this crazy Slavic person to our American Thanksgiving? What is your favorite Ukrainian foods? Like from from like what are the things that remind you of home? I don't really have that many good memories. Oh. Hello darkness, my old friend. The, the food is so very sad. I personally didn't have a big food culture. Mm. Or yeah. maybe I was just a skinny bitch. I don't know. I, <laughs> whatever that was, I just Yeah, you weren't you weren't But I do like simple foods. Not I don't food like the comp not food motivated at all. Oleg is like people motivated. He loves people. I don't like certain people. people. I'm not really people motivated. Like if I know there's good food somewhere, I'm more likely to go hang out with people that I don't like. Like that's enough to get me off. But if I, I know that's the only reason you've been watching UFC over the last six That's the six only reason months. I hang out with you is because you feed me. I mean, let's be honest. <laughs> I mean, I know there's not much I bring to the table. Thanksgiving time. Are we here? We're here. We are here. Do I need my wallet over there? Huh? <laughs> he doesn't know what technology this is. What are you yeah. doing? It's cool. It's um it's oh, called it's the a gimbal. I'll show you. Thing. I'll show you. Hi, Hi I'm <laughs> Oleg. This is Gene Yeager. Hi. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Uh oh. Yeah, hold it up again. Yeah, hold it up again. Cheers. No, no, yeah. Show the, show the. Did you see in your charm. bathroom? Show the little charm on the bottom. Did you see in your yeah. bathroom? Wow. That oh, Uncle B put. Oh, there. <laughs> yeah, a big one, a big one, a big one. I've heard people say that too much of anything is not good for you, baby. Aww. You're done. Don't start. So, you guys Steve, have... will you grab the uh, tray there? The juices? Uh-huh. Oh, Whoa! Gentle rain 
for sunny skies above. Yeah. <laughs> for home and friends, for peace and joy, but most of all for love. Each of us must have something that we are most <laughs> So we wrote Thanksgiving cards to everybody that we thought would be here from our family. Oh, we all did that? We all did. Yeah. Before we I remember. Before we uh -huh. Let me, Pipe, let me tell you what he said. Uh, so, so this guy, Pipe, is going to be there. Goes, yeah. Really? Kim's boyfriend, new guy? He goes, oh, good. I'm not in the fresh meat anymore. <laughs> yeah. Glad not to be the fresh one anymore, and uh, we are thankful that you have made your pilgrimage to America and oh. to Eva's heart. Oh. That's so sweet. Thank you. You know what? I saw a thing on 65 Minutes once. They were talking about the Thanksgiving dinner and the way they had the the Russian I do not. I, what's, I don't know the last word. I don't speak. I don't speak that word. Okay, babe, say it in Russian. Say it in Russian, and maybe I'll help him. Я не грустный, я трезвый. I don't know the last word. Yeah. How about the first one? What? How about the first one? I do not speak. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, this says, I'm not sad. I'm sober. I'm sober. <laughs> what is this? We'll sweat for champagne, that's really what mine says. Why is everything champagne? Yeah, <laughs> buddy. <laughs>
I have made kefir before, like with a, a little, uh, and like a little alien and you, you ferment it and stuff like that. What is it? They call it scoby. No. So it's, it's your traditional summer, summer drink. That's better than the stuff I make. It's really nice. Because it's made from that kind of bread. It's made from this bread. From the black bread. Oh. So this one is like bright, bright green. And it smells like black licorice, which is very strange. And it has a black licorice taste. That's bomb. If you like black licorice, that's really good. This one has pine cones all over it. And I don't know what it's supposed to taste like. Is it supposed to be like that one? I don't know. You said it's like a soda. That's like, oh. A smell that's very like piney. It is piney, a piney smell. That is very good. It has a very florally piney taste. I think I like the green one the best. So we've tried all three of the drinks. Is it ready? It's boiling. It's boiling, I'm waiting and I'm stirring it a little bit. And sometimes I'll add seasoning to the water too. I just go like that and then Sometimes I'll put like, this is like a, the one from Trader Joe's, the 21 so, uh, seasoning. Just season the water a little bit. I don't like it. You do because I've made it for you like this before and you liked it. I like it a lot. Boiling water in those little babies. which is like the easiest dough to make ever. It's literally just flour, water, egg, egg, and then you just get minced beef, veal, pork. I guess you could do anything, chicken. If it's that easy to make, I mean, but it's, it's actually you wonder, very, why do you never make them? It's very tedious. It's easy ingredients, incredibly tedious to make. I'll have to maybe insert a clip of in here of me actually making them using this. She's like totally so, like she's reaming me for my meetings. No, no, no. So you, she she's saying don't. I'm a city girl. I'm sorry. I so don't with your, eat dough with, with by your hand. fingers, you sort of <laughs> sort of do it with your knuckles. <laughs> there you go. No, you're doing great. Just fantastic. Oh my goodness, looks so good. Yeah, not nice to saying that, you know, cooking is not always easy. So these I've never tried before, and I've melted butter in them. I put molasses on mm. it, and I put pumpkin pie spice, just because, you know, it's Thanksgiving. Just because you can? And because I can. How is it? Bomb. No, seriously, though. No, they're good. Though, People honestly, usually eat that with the sour cream. I can see that. Especially the sour ones, the ones with the... Uh, yeah with mushrooms or the ones with potato. Those are the most popular ones and they're called vareniki. Basically the same concept with the pimini, except what's inside. Now, we're gonna try on camera. I'm gonna try Kinder. He might not wanna try it because he's like one track mind. He will only eat the next thing after he's done eating this. He's very, very particular. What's in the middle? Deliciousness. Leftovers of an angel. I'm not know. really like a big candy person. Don't shut up. What do you mean you're not a big candy person? I mean, everybody likes candy, but like, if I had to choose. I don't. I choose this. I don't. These look very cute. I said that they were cherries before, they're not. They're cranberries. I love trying food from different places. It's Careful so much fun. There's a lot of powdered sugar. Oh my gosh. So these look like a little dried. And you can hear them, the little cranberry side. Oh yeah? Ooh. Holy moly, not with my teeth. I thought the cranberry was gonna be dried in there, but it's actually kind of juicy. That's kind of delightful. Yeah? Mm-hmm. 
Mm -hmm. And outside, it's really sweet. It's like this hard candy coating and then the powdered sugar. And then inside, it's, it's a cranberry. So that's it. So yeah, now we're having second Thanksgiving because Ollie did not like the food that we had at Thanksgiving and I felt really, really bad. So this is making up for it, hopefully. Well, the important part is I did like the company at the first Thanksgiving and I like the company of the second one. Yeah, it was nice to and see And that's what matters. That is what matters. Hopefully you guys had a good holiday too.